Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Durkheim Battle video. In this video we are going to take a look at the Otherworld Warriors stages of the Dokkan All-Stars Raid. So basically we're going to take a look at the Otherworld Warriors stages and just take a look at the team build that I'll be using. Obviously I think most players uh, will have started getting to this point or at least will get to this point eventually. Uh, the Otherworld Warriors is a category that kind of got uh, buffed recently with the release of the Physical Angel Debora and the AGL Paikuhan uh, as well. So there's been some decent buffs to the category, which I think helps it out a lot more than what you see here. Uh, so when I was doing this video, there wasn't actually these units around. So having them this. available does actually help out quite a bit because Obviously, I think Otherworld Warriors was a pretty weak category, uh, and even leader-wise, it is still pretty weak. Uh, in terms of options, you don't have a lot of options in terms of your Otherworld Warriors category teams. You have like the Int Super Saiyan 2, into Super Saiyan 3 transforming Goku, uh, or you have the Physical Freezer, uh, both of which are still pretty decent units, but generally speaking, there's not a ton of them around, so it's pretty good. To obviously have I would say you know these units at least as an option uh, and to have them now to have the Pikehan to have the uh, Deborah I think does help out quite a bit so yeah when I was doing this it was a little bit uh, more difficult I want to say but generally speaking it was you know it's improved now I think for a lot of players so it's stage 341 uh, and then it obviously goes all the way up to 355 or 354 it's not the uh, like furthest stage or anything so it's not like the uh, yeah it's not one of the biggest categories I want to say so it's a pretty straightforward category there's nothing too crazy about it uh, there's not tons of stages right, so you shouldn't have that this. many problems with trying to run the stage and we're trying to get this done so you don't get too many dragon stones here but it is a necessary uh, one to do you can generally just overpower it if you want. With a super strong team, it's still not too hard, relatively. But the units here are immune to stunning and immune to sealing, so you'd have to remember to kind of juggle around that. But generally speaking, I found that I didn't have such a such a bad time. I found that you know overall I had a pretty decent time, uh, and yeah, for my sake, or at least you know talking about uh, this section I think most players won't struggle uh, the freezer the you know freezer revenge unit was very very bad uh, but it's understandable considering that you know the team is running on some pretty low stats and yeah just in general things aren't necessarily uh, working you know too well with such low stats on this team at least but yeah, for the most part, shouldn't really have like any major concerns. Obviously, if you are uh, a player that's maybe you know just kind of starting or looking to get going with uh, you know the Dokken All Stars raid, then obviously you do need to be aware that uh, you know this section could cause you some problems. Especially if you're a brand new player, there's not a lot of other World Warriors category banners or units out right now. So it is something that you're going to have to, you're going to have to probably just be slightly cognizant of. Well. But yeah, overall, everything went more than fine. And yeah, that's about it for me. Obviously, the next section will change uh, and we'll tackle that one separately as well. But yeah, for me, that's it. Thanks for watching and bye.